With Manipur only days away to vote for its 2022 assembly elections, poll campaigns are gradually picking up pace in the state. I am at 5 Thongjou con Assembly constituency where former Chief Minister Ibobe Singh is here to campaign for the candidate Mr. Sarem Nekim Singh. I have with me three-time former Chief Minister of Manipur from Congress, Mr. Ibo B. Singh. Uh, sir, you are here at uh, Thangjo constituency uh, campaigning for Mr. Sarim Lekin, who is the first-time candidate uh, contesting in the elections. How confident are you that he'll be able to come up as a victor against Mr. Biswajit, who has, been, who has a, had a strong hold, hold, strong hold in the area? No, <laughs> see, the people of Manipur, particularly people of Thangjo assembly constituency, they know they have already tested for the last five years. Only chief publicity, this BJP government, including Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modiji, and here also BJP-led government in Manipur, and more particularly, Mr. Biswajit Singh. He may be holding a lot of department, but on the ground, nothing is there. So we have full confidence the people of Thongju Assembly constituency will definitely vote for our candidate, Mr. S. Nikem. Uh, sir, last time also we saw that Congress came out with a uh, majority, and despite that, uh, the BJP came to power. So what? Uh, how, uh, how can you make sure that this, if con the Congress has enough seats, and uh, such a situation will not arise? No, uh, that's why we always said that, you know, this Narendra Modi ji government at the center and as well as in the state, they are just like dictatorship. They are, you know, they are doing here, including the honorable governor. See how the uh, majority, single largest ma majority, single largest party, that is our party, we rush to the assembly and meet the governor. We approach her for forming government and please, invite us so that if we are not able to show the protest, we cannot prove majority on the floor of the house. It's all right. But they are forcefully, illegally, unconstitutionally, they have taken one MLA from Congress. That two leader of the house, they have submitted lease of the Council of Ministers. In that lease, one Mr. Sam Kumar Singh, elected from Andro Assembly constituency, and in the last column, they are sponsored by Indian National Congress. How can governor can approve that? That is against the constitution, against the 10th schedule. She can advise to the leader of the house, no, sorry, on the floor of the house, you can count for, uh, for enable you to prove majority, but sorry, I cannot. Except this is against the constitution, against the law. MLA who are elected from INC, and how can I approve for inducting him in the Council of Ministers? He, she cannot say. That's why this is a uh, dictator government and unconstitutional illegal. They are doing all these things one by one. So that, you know, that cannot be practiced now this time. If a situation arises for a coalition, uh, who is the who will the Congress consider to join hands with? No, see, you know, we hope at the moment we will definitely win an you know, absolute single largest, not only single largest, in the event of single largest, there are many like-minded other parties and we will join together. At the moment we we thought that you know, we will get an you know, absolute majority. Uh, BJP has at the same time banking uh, for development. What are the prime agendas uh, that the Congress is upholding uh, in, the, in this election? No, no, you know the people of Manipur is not a foolish. They know they have already tested last five years. So what Congress has done and this BJP, what they have done, people of Manipur, they know. So therefore uh, there is a lot of difference between Congress and the BJP. That's why they will not you know, give what this time.
Thank you. Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Well, uh, that was uh, Mr. Ibobi Singh, former three-time Chief Minister from Manipur, and he is quite confident that the Congress will come out as the single largest party in the 20, upcoming 2022 Assembly elections. I'm Kalyan Dev with Camera Person Mukutmethi, reporting from Manipur, Imphal. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to East Mojo. For any queries, put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications.